And that's where you're seeing you get hung up as he starts Very driving those moves up. Sometimes I'll leave you to this platform like this. Okay. So let's do that full speed one more time when you see it, your setup. And you're dropping your knees like that every time in order to get your, your drive? Yes. Okay. So first thing would be, so you like, you like leaving open space, right? Yes. You don't, you don't go off. Uh, I usually okay. do like that. Okay. Uh, well, the first thing would be, instead of relying on this to swim through, this is not always a reliable thing. So he posts, or he goes to reach, like especially the old a lot. As he's coming out, don't come out and just allow him to attach to it. Because now if he's grabbing the gear, or sure, I'm not going to get in here. So I need to make sure that he doesn't get this or I strip grip. So the, the easiest way would be, especially if he's posting or he's got a knee grip, as he's reaching, I'm going to catch hand and elbow. So I go cross grip elbow, or cross grip, grip wrist, same side elbow, and I'm going to drive through. Now most of the time when I drag, or even if he goes collar tie, and I collar tie off, I throw my, he's going to yank his arm out. He's going to try to square. So right there, if I can get him to pull his arm back, so I'm going to come here. If I can get him to pull his arm back, I can shoot it into a single. And now, a lot of times, I don't want to put my head on the outside for a, for a single, so I'm going to hit him with my head, and I'm going to move him back. Because if he's heavy here, and I try to do a good stance, and I just try to pick his leg up, it's really hard. So I want to hit him with my with my head as I drive in. And move in, and move in, and collapse, or uh, pinch those knees in. Now, since you like to go to that double, instead of keeping your head over here and reaching far side, as you reach, I'm going to go ahead and swing the leg to the outside and go belly to belly, popping my head to the outside here. And his chin. you got to line your body up wrong. So, even if I was to just start here, I would have to be this way if you're going to reach for this leg at all. So, here, pull back. Now, if you can't push off to that double, the thing clear, headbutt, grab up here. And now, instead of trying to always reach for this leg here, turn around. You can keep your head on the inside for this one. I drop my head slightly to the outside right when I go for it. I don't want to hang out with it out here. You can do like a military style turnaround. Cross the feet, cross the feet back, and bow. Pushing my shoulder into it. Now, he's still got his knees up, so I'm not going to fall on Because if I fall on him, now he can start tying me up half guard knee shield. As soon as I, as soon as I throw him, <coughs> my hands are here. I want to go ahead and transition to uh, ankle and knee. And just back to the kick pass. <coughs> so I've gone to kick back. Clear. Headbutt. Hitch tight. Now, if you do reach, so this one you can even block this leg. And now, keep him going here. Boom, boom. Go ahead and give it a shot. So, which one were you going for? Double or the spin? The spin. Okay, so go ahead and get in there in position. <laughs> now, instead of grabbing that, just go ahead and both hands on this side, and now turn to this side here, and then tick your chest and push down on his thigh. Spin. Yeah. And now come right there. Back step. Yeah, so when you get him up here, I'm going to... Then instead of trying to like go back up and try to pull him onto you, so once I go here, I don't want to do this and start trying to pull him down. As soon as I go, I want to turn and I want to push in his, push in his thigh and his hip with my chest. I can even take one hand and cut the ankle. And now, bow. Put your <laughs> So I want him to pull on this side that the leg is not there. Yeah. So instead of snatching, run into him. Push into him. Yeah. Now spin. And then pass right, right away. Yes. And if you get him to spin a lot, then drop 
in the north south. Go ahead again. <laughs> and you just right there, just drop right into it. Now I'll switch off double. Now from right there, you're gonna wanna clear his leg to the outside here. So open this up. Yeah, and now step this right foot in line with his foot here. So go belly belly, head on the outside, and now look up right here. And now hips in, clear the legs. Yes. So that way you're not you're not in front of him. Because if you try to stay right here and try to throw the double, either this leg is gonna get put back inside and he can kind of block me. And now it kind of takes my hips out. I can't get my hips in. So I want to clear it and hips in. Now, if I try to go straight, then I'm going to land in half guard. So I'm going to go here and sweep the legs to the outside. Clear, step in. Drive in, hips in, head up. So you also want to use your head to push over. So even just right here, once I get double, I'm just going to look up and over here. So that, that way I don't have to have such a big lift on this side here. All I have to do is pop my hips in. Thank <laughs> you. 